In the shadowy corners of late-night television, a new phenomenon emerged during the 1950s and early 1960s, born from the inimitable allure of Vampyra, the first gothic horror hostess. Her show was but a brief candle in the darkness, snuffed out in one short but seductive season. She was gone too soon, but she had ignited a fire in the hearts of young women across the nation. Seduced by her darkness, and ready to step into their own, if smaller, spotlights. As the world recovered from post-war anxieties and plunged into the Cold War era, American TV screens flickered with strange tales of creatures, sci-fi monsters, and creaky old mansions. Local markets were eager to mine these fears at a profit via late-night television. Campaigns associated with the studios in Hollywood churning out good horror and less than good schlock bundled them together for resale across America. Female horror hosts, dark, mysterious, and often humorous, emerged as the torchbearers of this new genre, drawing on themes of camp, goth, and emerging rockabilly subcultures. Their unique styles captivated audiences influencing the growing obsession with the macabre, while also reflecting the social and cultural tensions of their time. Each hostess took Vampyra's template and reinterpreted in ways that resonated with their local audiences. These women embodied not only gothic charm, but also tapped into themes of rebellion, sexual empowerment, and the fear of the unknown in an increasingly uncertain world.
The party's over, boy. So close those coffin lids. The late-night horror show tradition, spearheaded by these early Gothic goddesses, remains a beloved part of American television history. Their influence on horror culture, especially the Gothic, retro-futuristic blending of styles, cannot be overstated. From their glamorous costumes to their devilish charm, they laid the groundwork for countless horror hosts to come, proving that darkness and mystery could indeed be irresistible. These hostesses not only redefined Gothic femininity, but they also reflected the cultural climate of the late 50s and early 60s. Rockabilly Rebellion, which married upbeat music with morbid imagery, played a significant role in influencing the aesthetic of these hosts. The emerging fascination with space and science fiction, reflected in the films they introduced, gave them a broader context. Horror and science fiction often addressed Cold War anxieties, the JFK assassination's impact on national uncertainty, and the growing obsession with the apocalypse. This was also a period that saw the rise of dark humor in pop culture, and these hosts cleverly mixed horror with wit, ensuring their appeal was as entertaining as it was chilling, by embodying both allure and darkness. These women forged new ground in a genre that continues to thrive today. <laughs>